In tonight's Rebound Detroit, the growing problem of food insecurity. Soaring prices at the grocery store are only making things worse. Well, now some school districts are facing unprecedented challenges as they try to help families struggling to put food on the table. How are you today? You want to be doing two and three today? In the age of social distancing. Morning, Olivia. How are you today? Jay Townsend is finding a way to get close to people, even when he's six feet apart. What do you have for a number for me? I have two kids, two adults. Perfect. Jay's is the first face families see when they come to get a free meal from their school. His face is covered, but his message is clear. Just talk to them like regular people. How are you today? I'm not here to judge, I'm here to help. A critical service for families facing food insecurity. Every little bit counts. Shia Lankalodia and her two boys walk here almost every day. Without these meals, she doesn't know how she would afford her grocery bill. Accepting help, though, was not that easy at first. There you go. Just a pride thing, I guess. It's just kind of hard to accept, you know, to, to make yourself vulnerable. It's, it's really hard to do that as a human being. There you go. Thank how are you today? You. Coast to coast, meal pickup sites are only getting busier. It's about community. It's about lending a hand. Jane McLucas is the food service director for this picturesque coastal town where the economy has come to a halt. Nearly 78% of students qualified for free or reduced lunch, and that was before this pandemic. The need get, is getting greater and greater. More people are feeling the pinch. It's not gonna stop, we're gonna keep going, and we'll feed these kids through the summer. Yeah, we've been doing like 180, 200. And there's this. Officials are realizing some families don't have access to transportation, so they're expanding food pickup sites and they're considering home delivery. Because no one can learn when they're hungry. As for Jay Townsend, he'll be here every day as long as families need him. It's one less thing they have to worry about. It's not hanging over their heads. Because making ends meet right now means relying on those willing to lend a hand. So here's the rebound rundown. The need for food during this pandemic is growing, and the need is widespread. Some families do not have transportation and need home delivery or help picking up food. And if everyone who can help will do their part, we will get through this food crisis together. And to make sure kids are fed through the summer, the USDA announced new measures this week. School districts nationwide can now continue to have flexibility on how they offer free and reduced meals. Those nationwide waivers have been extended through August 31st, which will help a lot of families. The Rebound Detroit is our commitment to stories that will help you navigate these uncertain times. Email us at rebounddetroit at wxyz.com with your story ideas or how your communities are stepping up during this crisis. Dave.